Good morning, YouTube. Today, um, I thought I would make a golden turmeric latte. So basically, all you need is some almond milk. Um, the unsweetened one's a little bit better for this, and I have the vanilla just to kind of balance off that spicy turmeric. Um, collagen is optional, but I love the benefits of collagen, so I'm going to throw that in here. Coconut oil is also optional, but you know me, I love coconut oil, so we're going to throw that in. Then we have some ground ginger, some ground clove, and of course, ground turmeric. These are all from Bulk Barn. I love to go there for like little spices and stuff, especially when I'm just trying out recipes. Um, and I don't want to buy like a giant tub of something. Uh, cinnamon for taste, some measuring cups, measuring spoons. These are super cute, they were gifted to me for Christmas, and then a cup. I'm first going to take a one cup measuring cup and pour a full cup of the vanilla almond milk in. of the turmeric that's what kind of gives it its golden look and turmeric is really it's called like the healing spice so it has a lot of antioxidants anti-inflammatory properties helps with digestion people with IBS um, really benefit from it any bloating um, just really good overall one teaspoon of turmeric and this can be a little difficult to like taste if you're not used to it so a lot of people end up adding like honey or maple syrup or something like that um, so that's an option as well I should have probably just put this straight into the blender but that's fine too late now so that's one teaspoon of the can't really one teaspoon of the turmeric now we're gonna do a little bit of ginger. Ginger is also great, especially in the winter to boost the immune system, as well as digestion as well. I'm going to do a little bit less than a teaspoon, just so I don't want to add any sweeteners, so that's that. And a tiny bit of clove. some cinnamon this is great for lowering cholesterol and balancing um, blood sugar levels I'm gonna do a tiny bit of coconut oil this is great um, it's a great healthy fat <laughs> Looks like art right now. And then I'm gonna do like half a teaspoon of this is the Vital Proteins collagen peptides. I'm gonna do like three quarters of a spoon of that. This is also really good for digestion. Um, helps with healthy bones, skin, hair, nails, um, joints. Also really good for skin hydration. This is the collagen peptides. It has a great amino acid profile as well. So for recovery, post-workout is great. So I'm going to just mix that in. And then I'm going to put it into the blender to blend it nicely before we heat it up on the stove. That looks like a lot more in my cup than it did in shaker, but that's good. So it's got its nice uh, golden turmeric color. I'm going to put this up uh, on the stove to kind of cook for a little bit. Um, and with this, basically the longer you let the turmeric milk simmer, the stronger the flavor will be. So heating it for like five minutes is probably a good starting point. And then you can go from there. Um, you can taste test it and you can add honey or maple syrup um, each time if you want to 
like do less and less like to kind of adjust to the turmeric taste or dates are great if you're blending um, and coconut oil is also good for adding in healthy fats um, and you could also do it over ice as well but since it's like a cold gloomy day outside I'm just gonna drink it nice and warm you guys man am i impressed with sephora i literally placed an order yesterday because i had some gift cards from christmas and it arrived today like before the afternoon even um i have packages i've been waiting on from like months ago that still haven't shown up so damn i'm gonna be ordering more often Honestly, ordering that package online probably took faster than actually going into the store because ain't nobody got time for those Sephora lines and that was pretty darn quick. So we're here in Niagara. We just got back from a dinner. We went to Coco Cabana, which is like a Brazilian steakhouse where they serve the meat. And the waiter himself walked over and said like, uh, you guys are doing so good. What did they say, Jake? She was impressed with us. We did really well. Um, this is what we're wearing. A little like bodysuit thing from Honey. A little fur jacket from Honey. And then black jeans from Topshop. And booties from Aldo. And then a little like chain thing here. Chain necklace. That was a dinner date outfit. Jake, show them your outfit. Look at this handsome guy. So you got a little dress shirt. Where's your dress shirt from? Uh, Express? Yes. Maybe? And your jacket? Uh, I did. I don't know. Express. Express. <laughs> we got it for you. A little jeans from American Eagle. Come over here. It's too dark. And little booties from? Sophomore. I don't, know, I don't know what the brand is. That's okay. Look at a handsome. <laughs> And now we're heading to... I don't know. <laughs> Where are we heading? The Festival of the Lights. Yes, we're heading down by the Niagara Falls. Um, for They have like a little winter festival of lights. So like everything is lit up and illuminated and cool little stuff going on. Yeah. How was dinner? I'm so full. I'm so fat. <laughs> I'm so fat. They brought us like a little dessert with these like sugar chewy things. And like we just just tapped out. We couldn't do it anymore. But we did really well. They The, the owner even said we... We're impressive, <laughs> so we held our own. on my first trip of 2018 um, shortly I thought I would share some airplane essentials that I like to carry in this little pouch and these are more like nutrition and wellness based uh, obviously I still like to have like my water and my snacks uh, so first off some sort of like Kleenex or wet wipes those are great a little hand cream this one's by EOS smells really nice uh, deodorant so this is by Freedom it's a all-natural deodorant 
you're going to be sitting really close to people, so you want to make sure you have your deodorant on. And this one's aluminum free, which is also very important. I'll just pour this out and do it that way. A little Vichy thermal facial spray to refresh after a long flight or just kind of wake yourself up a little bit, hydrate your skin because your skin does really dry out on a plane. Uh, gum's great for popping your ears or just something to chew on. Oh, I love these little ginger chews. They help with like plain nausea, um, digestion, and also popping ears as well. So I love these little ginger chews. These are like the mango flavor. A little moisturizer samples that could be for your face when it gets dries out uh, on the plane yes vitamin C this is the acai berry flavor um, when flying sometimes people get sick because the airport has a lot of germs and um, so this will boost your immune system nicely cold Q this was given to me recently by a naturopath friend of mine um, and this basically you just use it it's an oral spray um, it says like around gyms or when you're in clinics or airports um, so you spray it in your mouth half an hour before you eat or drink anything um, and that's supposed to help reduce that as well and it's like a natural version too so no junk in there I always carry around my peppermint oil by sage this helps with headaches helps me relax a little bit same with nausea and stuff like that this is great so this is the peppermint halo I love it so much it's almost empty but enough for the trip a little sugar lip balm when your lips get dried out anything I love Vaseline as well or coconut oil this is the uplift by province apothecary it's just like a natural scent because um, on planes you know you don't really want to sit next to someone who's overloaded with perfume or cologne so this is uplift It's an all-natural kind of energizing happy essential oil blend Lip Glow, I don't know if I've talked about this before, it's by Dior, I just bought, I just got this one in the mail, my other one's like pretty much empty, it's at the plastic part so it's cutting up my lips, but it's just like a little sheer color and it like brings out the natural lip of your, brings out the natural color of your lips which is really nice because I'm not one to really like to wear lipstick on an everyday basis so this is kind of just gives your lips like a nice glow and color um, and that's great little eye makeup remover wipes um, if your makeup gets smeared or just a wipe underneath your eyes some bobby pins i guess a piece of christmas tree and i usually like to have like a hair elastic um, in there as well so these are my airplane essentials like i said i always like to have like a big scarf with me as well or like big sweater to just kind of bundle up because um, it gets pretty cold and also water and some like a snack or a bar or something is there something else in here? Oh yeah. And also, I like to bring a little tea with me, Jade Citrus Mint, when I'm traveling. So I could just ask for hot water and do that. Or I can always pick up a tea there. But these are some of my faves. Let me know in the comments below if you have any travel essentials that I should check out. Um, this is just like what I like to keep in this little baggie here. And nothing too heavy. All TSA approved, hopefully. How about this guy? Maybe. Maybe not this. But I think so. I'll let you know, I guess. <laughs>